Hey, how's it going everybody? Welcome back to the Scarecorp channel. Today we'll be testing the Dewalt battery pack against my electrical wood furnace. Let's take a look. All right, and we're back. Here we've got the Dewalt power pack. It's a 100 watt inverter. Can also do the 2800 amp um, car starter. It's got these AC plugs. Supposedly it can handle the 100 watts. This is a 12, couple 12 volt batteries inside at 21 amp hours. So I'm not sure how long that lasts. You guys could do the math. But today we're hoping that it will run our Tundra 2 wood furnace. Okay, so this obviously would be emergency only. Power goes out. Uh, you don't have a generator. You've got one of those bad boys there. And hopefully it could run it. So this guy here the blower is rated at 120 volts 3.8 to i think 4.3 amps so we're looking anywhere between 400 and 500 uh, watts so that's about half the power of this guy so any luck it should fire up. Now I don't have this thing fully charged. It's actually only one bar. <laughs> so uh, these things take about uh, about 24 hours to a little bit longer to charge. So this thing kind of been sitting in my uh, one of my vehicles as an emergency unit. So, let's see what we can do. So this just comes with a AC unit, 120 volt. Uh, okay, let's plug this guy in. Okay, we're plugged in. And all we should have to do is hit the AC power and hopefully she'll go. Okay, that's heard that okay so it looks like it's going right on okay that just means I don't have a thermostat hooked up 485 give or take Watts. I saw it surge to 600 and some. So we got one battery here. Probably won't last forever. But it is running my furnace. So if power goes out in the area, I uh, am able to use this guy to heat my home. And you know, I would have to do the math to see how long it would last. Uh, you can post down below if you uh, if you figured it out already for me. That's 20 amp, 21 amp hours times two, uh, 12 volts, and about let's say 500 watts, right? I'm sure, there's a calculation for that. But uh, I'm quite happy with it. It'll run this sucker, so. Power goes out. I can uh, keep my family warm. Very pleased with this. And um, yeah, a guy could get a generator, put it outside, deal with the fuel, uh, you know, the noise. But um, tell you what this is good for. Turn this guy off. 
tell you what this is good for. It's for uh, for something really quick. You know, you don't have to fight with the generator. You don't have to run any cords. If you're not really set up for that, this is gonna work a lot better for you. And say if you're away and your wife is uh, at home, you know, she do doesn't really want to deal with all that generator stuff. This is perfect. You know, um, you can maybe even train one of your smaller kids, you know, if you got a young teen in the house. They could probably run this and figure it out. You know, plug it in, press the AC, uh, and just keep it charged for them and, you know, uh, we'll figure out how uh, how long this thing should last for, but... But that's great. I'm very uh, pleased with it. So it's good buy. They're about uh, 300 bucks, I think, on sale. Um, I think 350 or, or so uh, not on sale. But uh, I've used this guy already to jumpstart my car, which uh, you saw a video of that earlier. Check that out. I go more in depth about all the buttons and how to charge it and. All that kind of good stuff, so check that one out as well. Well guys, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. I very much appreciate that. It helps the channel. If uh, you have any comments, uh, let me know down below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, hit the subscribe button. You'll get uh, these videos and others uh, uh, as soon as they come out. Well guys, that is it for my time. And as always, I thank you for yours. See you in my next video. Bye. Badass.